In this video, we're going to show you how to set up the external lighting options in this Nova ATM. Let me show you how it works. To adjust the lighting options, begin by entering the Operator Function menu. From within the Operator Function menu, choose System Setup, then Device Setup, then Nova LED. From within this screen, you can adjust all of the lighting options. Beginning up at the top, Idle, Welcome Mode. This is how the machine will behave when it's sitting idle or no one is using it. You have several options. First is Cycling. Cycling will go through all of the various colors by fading in and out from one color to the next, and it allows you to choose which colors are shown and which ones are not. The next Idle Mode is Flickering. Flickering will turn the chosen color on and off as long as the machine is idle. The next option is Fade In and Out. This will use the chosen color that you've picked and will fade it in and out slowly as the machine sits idle. The next option is Solid Lighting. Solid Lighting will just simply show whatever chosen color you have, but it does allow you to set the brightness. Use this button to set the brightness between low, medium, and high for how bright the lights on the front of the machine will appear. This option can only be used within the solid lighting mode as the other will be flickering on and off or fading in and out. The final option in this menu is just to turn the outside lighting off. This will disable the lighting until the customer begins a transaction. You can customize the color choice in this menu by using the idle or welcome down here at the bottom of the screen. The color choices are green, blue, cyan, yellow green, violet, and white. If you've chosen the cycling option for your idle mode, then you can select which colors will be shown and which colors will not as part of the cycling process. By default, all six colors are, are shown in the rotation. However, if you choose the idle color mode, you can select which colors to enable or disable. If you don't want the machine to show violet, you can simply set that to disabled and that won't be part of the rotation. Finally, from this menu, you have the option to set the transaction color. This is the color that will come on in both the keypad section and the cash tray section when a customer is doing a transaction. You can choose any of the colors that are available. For this example, I've chosen the idle mode to be solid lighting, and I've selected the color green as the idle color. And then I've chosen the transaction color to be violet. This is what that would look like for the customer. I'd also like to note that while trying to film this demonstration, we found that it was really difficult to capture the vibrance of the colors uh, from these LEDs. They, the colors are far more defined uh, in person than they show in these videos. I hope you have found this helpful. If you have any questions, please contact Jamega Support.